Hello everyone, it's Jackie Rose with Jackie'sRamblings.com. Um, today I'm doing like a nachos or taco salad mukbang. You tell me. I made homemade nachos. See? With guacamole, homemade refried beans, and homemade pico de gallo, and homemade corn, or corn tortilla chips. So here we go. I remember first time I made refried beans, it was years ago, and they were so bland. And I didn't realize at the time when I did make them that you can season them. So this time, I seasoned them. Mm. Really good. You know, all of this is so easy to make. Semi homemade because I used a can of pinto beans. I forgot to buy a can today, and I'm like, no, you know what? I should try to make um, semi homemade pinto or refried beans. Mm. This is good. So today I ran some errands, went and got copies of my divorce papers for the court and for my ex. Went to Starbucks. I just stay here. <laughs> Never liked Starbucks. Never. And I forgot a napkin again. But it was between Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks, and Starbucks tastes better. I did like when I lived in Utah beans and brew. They were good. That's who we used to go to. trying to get more creative with my cooking. Oh. oh yeah, so I have pico de gallo homemade, semi-homemade. Semi-homemade refried beans and then the guacamole I made yesterday when I made the fries, the, the chili guac fries. I was going to film outside, but it's too dark, so, or it's just the lighting is terrible. It's only better when I film, like, during the day outside. So I came back and I thought, oh, I guess I'll shoot in my room. I also cleaned this morning. And worked on my website. I have a couple. I have my blog and then I have my website. And they're both hosted, self-hosted on HostGator and use WordPress. So one is, the website is an actual WordPress theme. The other one's an actual blog, WordPress. I like fixing websites. It's rarely relaxing and stuff. I used to want to do it for other people, but I'm so simple with it, you know? And, pe and my designs are simple, and I like to, my own designs are simple. I just like to keep everything simple and, you know, not so costly, too. And most people don't want that. I'm going to eat some of this, too. You want flashy and stuff. Over the top, you know. Mm. This right here was a good idea. I'm glad I had leftover guac. I was like, what am I going to do now? My beans came out perfect this time, my refried beans. After the Thanksgiving holiday, so after next week, I'm going to put my dry lentils, which I've never really had. 
my dried brown rice in the rice cooker and the slow cooker. I'm trying to be, but this was made with a lot of oil. <laughs> Oops. I didn't put any salt on the fries or on the nachos like I normally would. Did I mention I forgot a napkin again? But cooking is fun sometimes. And other times, sometimes I don't feel like it. This morning for brunch, I had a smoothie and made a veggie burger. But I don't need breakfast. I just have coffee. Mm. It was so great. I went to Fry's, which is like Kroger, Smith's, whatever you call it in your city or state. Well, I knew that they had half and half, and I've been buying the smaller, the the pint, pint size. But I thought, oh, I need to buy the bigger one. So I bought the quart of half and half. It's not flavored or anything, really. It's not like the French vanilla, you know, that you would buy regularly, but it's just like half and half silk. And then I saw they had three different kinds of soy eggnog, well, soy and almond eggnog. So I bought the silk version because I know, I just know how silk tastes and it's easy to drink and stuff. And something in my boob it was a chip. But yeah, so I got me some eggnog, soy eggnog, so that's. Uh, Soy nog because there's no egg in it. My daughter doesn't like dairy neither, so we're both excited to try it. And then we got soy in our coffee at Starbucks, of course. Mm. And these nachos, I did great. I honestly did great. Mm. And my refried beans are so good. Mmm. I really need to buy more vegetables, so I'm like down to the, you know, but I'm finding out great ideas on what to do with what I have, so that's great. That's good. And I'm excited I got some videos to watch on YouTube now. All my favorite YouTubers updated. I'm just waiting for one more, which I think he's going to update tonight to me tomorrow. Patricia Peta's updated. Sarah's Vegan Kitchen updated. Cheap Lazy Vegan updated, but on her vlog, not on her Cheap Lazy Vegan food website or YouTube channel. So I'm excited. Watch some videos. And I got all my cleaning done except for one thing. Oh, let me tell you guys, this is my plan. Okay. I told you guys the story, <coughs> but now I'm continuing with the story about the cat I saw at Petco, Squishy. So anyway, I felt bad because they all looked like they were seeking attention, remember, when I went and got my dog's nails done? And um, so I texted a lady about volunteering to cuddle with them and stuff, you know, like during the day. So... Um, she texted me back and she said, yeah, they could always use more volunteers. So I'm excited. I'm going to go play with kitties. I feel so bad. I wish I could take them all home. I seriously do. Cats get a bad rap and I hate it. It pisses me off so bad. Oh, it makes me so mad. And people need to freaking leave possums alone, too. Oh, it makes me so angry. There's nothing I can do about it. I can send every petition in the world, and I still don't think it's enough. Because it's not. Really. Honestly. I'm so happy with this meal. I mean, I think these are better than my fries. And my fries were good, too. My fry meal. But I think these beans. Oh, my God. Oh, I love it. I should have made more nachos, though. No, I don't want to overeat. 
next time I got to do two can of refried beans, though, I think. Because this was only one can. It's like the perfect meal and perfect spicy. Forgot to add nuts, but I don't really need it. I add it to everything else, you know, even my smoothies. So, but yeah, so I'm gonna go play with kitties. Mm. I also added cinnamon with my refried beans. It's something different. I'm definitely gonna make it again. I want to start juicing, but I'm so lazy, I just blend, you know, because I have my Nutribullet. It's just so much easier, because juicing, I have to clean the whole freaking system. And I'm like, no, I don't want to. And with the Nutribullet, all you clean is the cup, you know. So I've been having, like, smoothies, like, three or four smoothies so far this week, which is good. Because I want to get back to doing that again, smoothies and juicing, you know. But I just mostly make good smoothies. My lazy ass. <laughs> I hate, I'm not a fan of cleaning. Oh yeah, this is so good. Mm. I have been doing my water thing very well. Shame on me. I'm trying, and then other days I'm just like, you know what? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I'm going to try to get a hold of things, so I got to. I need to. We all do. Get control of our future. Hmm. No, try to watch a movie tonight. I haven't been in no mood to watch any movies or anything. Or shows. I was watching Zoo. And I was like, uh, whatever. Last real good show I watched, I don't really remember. Oh! Um, Startup on Crackle. Yeah. That show is the bomb. And Crackle's free, so go check it out. Crack a lot home. That was, I think, the last real show I watched. Oh, you guys, I'm so proud of these beans this time. I'm going to make them exactly the same next time. Oh, so awesome. My teeth are a little sensitive because of the cold. From, like... What is cold? Oh, the guacamole. I'm happy because I'm actually like making semi-homemade stuff now. Usually I just buy it because I don't care. I'm trying to be healthier. I do need to cut back on my oil, but we got like two big things of oil from Costco. I'm like, I got to use it. I do all the cooking anyway, so. One thing I cannot stand, uh, anything, is wasted food. Because of literally, I like think about it, it's literally starving people, starving animals, it's just, makes me crazy. And I'm going to try to regularly donate to the food bank here. I'm glad they have one, it's really cool. We have a food bank and a thrift store, and all of the profits go to the food bank. Their thrift store is overpriced, though, but it's the same. For stuff you get for free, but that's okay. It's still a good thrift store, you know? I find some good stuff there. Mm. I get so good with this. And I have another half. I, I took like a bunch of tortillas, like five or six, and I just cut them. And I took two triangles, and then I put them in the frying pan. 
we have our fry daddy, fry daddy, but when I'm making such a small batch, I kind of see no point using the fry daddy. Like if I'm gonna make a big batch of fries or nachos, then yeah, I'll use the fry daddy, but for just me, no. Let's use the pan. These are so good, you guys. Oh my God. Oh, and I'm not full yet too, which is good. I just wish I had more nachos, but the stuff's almost gone anyways. And these freaking beans, oh my God, they're so good. You know what else I like to do? This one I don't feel like making anything. And this is why I wanted another can of refried beans is when I'm like hungry and I want something like really savory and good, I'll take a corn tortilla. No, I'll take diced tomatoes, onions, and serrano chili peppers, right? Cut up or diced. And fry it in the pan, right? With the oil. And then uh, oh my gosh. And then after I do that, I'll like grill my tortilla with semi-fried, you know, and put salt on it. I'm so bad with salt. We all are. Aren't we? And, uh, and then I'll take the can and I'll put it in the top of where, you know, the refried beans. And then I'll scoop out some after the tortilla is done and pop it in the microwave, right? For like 30 seconds. So it cooks, it's a good microwave. It's one of those high convention ones or whatever. And then I take the stuff, the sauteed veggies. I think I told you guys this, I can't remember. Anyway, it's an easy meal. I take the sauteed veggies and then I put them on the tortilla with the refried beans. It's like the best meal ever, the best. And sometimes I add avocado and sometimes I don't, you know, but it's so good. So I was thinking tonight, this is kind of like that, but a little bit more nice. It's so good. Oh, these beans. I hope my freaking thumbnail comes out better. The choices I had for the last one, the last two, well, the last one was okay. I just gotta finish up my last bit of cleaning or whatever. I keep a nice list on my planner, which I showed you guys. This is my big bulky one right now, which I can't wait to come using because it kind of sucks. But, um, yeah, I only have a couple, I gotta print off a couple things and then, yeah, clean something else. Then I'm done. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. My last tortilla. So I gotta make sure I get all the vegetables on it. Everything. And the last of the refried beans. Which I still have a little bit left and I still have those tortilla shells or those so I can make more of this tomorrow. Now of course I have the mix, you know, the tomatoes and onions. Tomorrow I might not do it with a napkin though. And I love sauteed onion or caramelized onion. I think my favorite part are the refried beans. <laughs> I might have choked on a chili, not choked on it, but. Mm. Yep. Serrano chili. 
Lots of guac, no tomato. I don't like to waste food, remember? It makes me crazy. I try not to give my dogs anything, really. Not too bad, you know. But, you know, you love your pets and you want to spoil them, so. And cats, too. Just for my cat. Just for that cat. Which, if you want to like her Facebook page, Baby's Cat World, you can. Done. And not full. I'm good. Here comes my daughter's cat. No kitten. Don't be ridiculous. It's all gone anyway. And none of it is for you. Too spicy and stuff. All gone. Oops. I gotta wash my hands. Y'all wanna see my dog? My Chihuahua, Shisha. Shisha is the name of what you put in hookah. Let me take a drink first. Water. I've been putting on my app 12 ounces a day. I think that's about, uh, probably a little bit more I've been drinking, but I don't, I want to be like fair and not lie to my app. <gasps> you know, I'm going to try to do better again someday soon. Come here, Shisha. Come here, Shisha. Come here. I want you in the camera. Look at my little red dog. Isn't she precious? Wait. You want to be in the camera too, kitten? No. Okay, Shisha. <laughs> See? She's spoiled. And she knows it. Hey, go play. Go play. Okay, I'll talk to you guys next week. Have a good week. Or, good weekend. Bye.